Well, the Kimberly girls basketball team put a cherry on the top of its summer season Wednesday. They won the summer league title. The papermakers beat De Pere. Both teams were missing some key players, of course. It's the summer. Kimberly, though, pleased its summer ended on a high note. Doug Ritchie with more. Kimberly edged De Pere 22-19 in a defensive-minded game Wednesday. De Pere scored more than 50 points in the earlier semifinal, but the Redbirds were stymied against Kimberly. Defense is going to keep you in every game. You're going to have a shot to win. So we just continually just stress that. And I know in the summer you don't get the day-to-day -day contact. But those concepts that we've developed throughout um, are there. So we just know our defense is so important. I'm just proud of our kids because they're carrying that over from last season. Winning a summer league basketball title, it doesn't guarantee success for this coming season. But winning the championship, it feels pretty good anyway. I think we always play to win. So no matter if it's a summer league or a conference game or anything like that, we always just want to be competitive and play to our best potential. Kimberly was without Fox Valley Association Player of the Year Frankie Wirtz. And her teammates were glad they were able to come through. Other girls had to step up, which was good because I think everyone played very well today and everyone had to step up and score for us. So it was a good time for others to get in the game. The summer league title was good to win, but Kimberly knows there's time and room for improvement. Well, I learned that we can improve more still, but we have a lot of good shooters on our team, and we just need to look up and step up. If one player is having a bad game, all of us just need to pick up each other up and play together. The papermakers do that, and months from now, they might just win another FEA title. In Kimberly, Doug Ritchie, Fox 11 Sports.